Well, Texas Longhorns know a thing or two about pressure, and after nearly a decade of walking through the wilderness, they appear to be back on the right track under Tom Herman. Baylor hosts them in the home finale in 2018. So for a look at what the Horns will be bringing to Waco, here's Mandy Knight. went out with a bang in 2018, beating Georgia in the Sugar Bowl. And if they want to pick up where they left off, Sam Ellinger will have to find a new number one wide receiver since little Jordan Humphrey is now in the NFL. LJ Humphrey, I mean, enormous shoes to fill, but we, we feel like our, our depth and talent at receiver uh, is such that um, we feel that that is a position of strength for us. Senior wide receiver Colin Johnson is one of the returning strengths Tom Herman is talking about, who finished 2018 with just under 1,000 receiving yards for seven touchdowns. We're extremely confident in where we're at as a program right now. We have the talent, we have the coaching, and that's that's pro that's been proven last year. We, we competed against um, OU in Georgia at a very, very high level, two of the best best teams in the country. And we've proved to ourselves when we play really well, we can hang in there and beat those teams. Ellinger has reason to be confident. After all, he set the Big 12 record last year for consecutive passes without an interception. Their offense has the potential to be just as good. Even though they lost their number one running back in Trey Watson, they have a diamond in the rough in Keontae Ingram. Our offensive line has a chance if we stay healthy to be as good as we've had here uh, in our three years. And the, the tailback position, uh, Keontae Ingram, this is a true freshman that, that rushed for over 700 yards uh, on limited carries because he missed some games due to injury. He's also put on 15, 20 pounds. Defense will be more of a challenge as there are several holes to fill after losing players to the NFL. We need to make improvements on defense. We've recruited very well. We've developed them in the weight room. We're going to be very young. There's, there's no secret to that. But young and talented is better than young and not talented, I can tell you that. Baylor plays Texas on Saturday, November 23rd at McLean Stadium. Reporting for Fox 44 Sports, I'm Mandy Knight.